Hello everyone. Welcome to Data on My View. In this video, I'm going to show how to get latitude and longitude column from your existing location or address columns. If you are not subscribed my channel, please click the subscribe button. Here I'm going to use Bing Map APIs. If you have Google Map APIs, still you can use that to get these two different columns, latitude and longitude. I have another video which I'm going to explain why we need these latitude and longitude columns. Okay, let us see how to get the latitude and longitude column from this location column. To get that, you need to visit Bing Maps, Bing Maps portal.com and click sign in. Sign in to Bing Maps. If you have an account, you can easily sign in with your Bing Maps uh, account. So once you have signed in, you can see my accounts. Under my accounts, you can see my keys. Okay, this is going to show you the Bing Map key. So this is the Bing Map key for my account. So you can easily generate for your account. So just copy paste that to a notepad. Once you have done, that's it. We don't want to go anything else inside this Bing Map portal. So once you got these uh, keys, we need to place these keys in the URL. So this is the URL that Bing Maps using behind the scenes to get the latitude and longitude columns. Right, so here we just, just need to replace this Bing Map key with your Bing Map key. So I just copy paste this. Pasted, I'm going to copy this whole URL. Go to powerbi.com. Sorry, powerbi desktop. And I'll click new source. Click web web data source. And pass this URL. And click OK. So here it is going to show as like this. Once uh, get this option, you can click OK. And it is going to show these many columns. So the last column you can see resource sets. Expand this column by clicking the table option. Again click table. Again click table on the resources. Then again on location. And here you can see different options. You have to click with point. So this point column has these two latitude and longitude columns. So as we are interested to get only latitude and longitude columns, you can just skip other columns and you can just click uh, click table 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 and until you get the point column so at last you'll get these latitude and longitude columns so once this is done you can go to advanced editor so this is the place we are going to convert this whole query into a function so let us convert that so we just need to pass a value to the function so let us say so let us say point let us see find latitude and longitude so i'm just so i just say find latitude and longitude equal to i'm just going to pass location right so then then i'm going to get that result so in same name find light and long and you have another step we need to replace this after locations we need to replace with the dynamic value so until this within double quotes add the and symbol and pass the name let's say location all right so once this is done you can click done and we got the function so i'm just going to replace the function name let's say find show code all right so we are going to use this function in this query so just select this location column and click add column here you can see invoke custom function click invoke custom function and pass the the newly created function find geocode and we are going to pass the location value as the input value to the function click ok 
so once that is done you can see find geo code it has a table so we are going to expand this by clicking this table so if you click this table it is going to show only the results for the first row to get but to get the values for all the rows you need to click this option and here you can see these are the two columns that we are interested in and check this click ok so we got latitude and longitude columns so this is how you need to get these latitude and longitude columns using Bing map apis please subscribe my channel for more videos thank you